Welcome to Good Mythical More. What's the word? This is when we see a word and we give a definition for hmm. it. The word today is collywobbles. Collywobbles. Uh, that's actually uh, what I wanted to name my daughter. Yeah, right. Well, this is when a collie gets into a big vat of Budweiser. <laughs> 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 or hams. Go ham on some Budweiser, I guess. <laughs> when a collie goes, goes ham, ham on, on some Budweiser, Budweiser, you get a collie wobble. A weird uh, feeling in it, your stomach. What does it mean for or real an overall bellyache. Huh. Oh, I've, yeah. I've heard that. All right, come on in, fellas. I've heard that. Mythical Chef Josh and Alex. Come bearing gifts. Alex Punch. Uh, we are going to taste... We're gonna go through a flight of Fago, it seems. Mm -hmm. You got cups right over there. Wow, guys, there's a lot of Fago. Yeah. Now belly, belly up to the bar. Grab this. Scoot on up. Oh, sorry. Just I, don't, I, don't I, be shy. You got strong hands. Don't be right shy. Right let's <laughs> let's touch thighs. Oh, wow. um, now, Josh. Yes. Excuse me. I've got I've got lots of carbonation trying to collie wobble its way up. Excuse pass, me. Pass those cups down, Link. Yeah. There you go. Oh, and you gotta pop each of these. So I have, I have Josh's what I presume to be a punishment soda. Well, I mean, there's freaking peppers at the top of. I mean, one man's punishment, another man's pleasure. You know what I mean? It's, it's all like good and bad. Yeah, my like punishment, your pleasure. Yeah. I do I know what you mean. You really do. So I was inspired. Uh, I really wanted to do like a kind of like Thai vinegar soda thing that I really enjoy. So I put like a little bit of vinegar into the cola, and I was like, dang, that's really good. And that was inspired by more things. So I put some fish sauce, some lime juice, a little bit of garlic, <laughs> and then some chilies floating That's at the right. top. So it should be kind of like, I, I think it's really well balanced. I'm interested to hear your opinion on it. You, you, are you trying to tell me you actually tried to make something good? Yeah. What a concept, right? <laughs> yeah. Um, and tell us about this picture on the front here. Did you get so, a shot of that? Yeah, so that picture, I was 11 years old and I got my first beer drinking helmet and um, I, I used it uh, for... Uh, I got my I believe first. It's How many have you had since then? Oh, like seven or eight. You gotta replace them every two years. Well, yeah, so right, you wear them out. Yeah, exactly. Um, yeah, I think that's like a Hanson's Mandarin Lime Soda and a Ginger Ale. And apparently I wasn't having a great time. I thought you'd look happy, so, but you, I was squinting. Do you want to save that, Link? For later on in the tasting process? Uh, sure, because I don't want to ruin everything. Mm -hmm. I think the big story was the Fago Cola. Which we yeah. will get to. We what, will get to. Alex like said there is an surprise. order to this. Yeah, so you start out with orange. Now, you're you Why is there an order? You're a Fago fan. Yeah, a Fago fanatic, you could a say. A Fago fanatic because yeah. it's Detroit's own, right? Detroit's own, you know, it's a juggalo thing. Um, so, cheers. Do you, do you identify as a juggalo? Uh... Some people have said that, not me. Um, because when I think mm. of Fago, I also think of New Grape, which is New Grape not made by Fago, because this is... Fago, like, Fago only makes Fago. Like, they're Detroit base. That's yeah. all they do. So, but like, New Grape will make grape, they will make orange, they make a couple of different flavors. New Grape too. started as grape, but then they started doing orange. I think that's the maybe, competitor to maybe, Fago. Make mm. barrier. And then there's, of course, Sunkist. Yeah. For the orange. I right. always like the Sunkist. I always like the Sunkist. And better than an orange crush. You start out with the orange because it tastes just like every other orange soda you've ever right, had. Right, right, right. There's nothing really special there, you know? It's, it's, it's top notch, though. It is made with 100% cane sugar. Yeah. Mm. That's exciting. As if that's not here. Any. Alex, where are we just going Just as next? bad for you as any other this one, I just want to do this one next because it's the most important one, so here you go. Have you drank Fago in Detroit? Uh, yeah. Proper? Yeah, oh yeah, at like a Tigers game. I don't make it out there too much, but uh, for what sporting it, events. What is this? This is kind of weird. Rock yeah, so this is rock and rye, so you tell Ooh. me what this flavor is. What do you think it is? Cheer wine. It's got like a yeah. It's, no. red. it's red. No, it tastes like a cream soda. It tastes like a a, a root beer float. A root beer float. It tastes like a. Uh, is it a big red? No, that's the gum. What's the red <laughs> soda? Red pop. Red pop. Well, that's weird because this is red pop. <laughs> ah. So it what do you think? Like it's like a brown red pop, pop with uh, with ice cream in it. Red pop. A, with it, ice has cream? A, it has a creaminess to it. You're right. There's a creamy. Uh, okay. The answer. I, I is... I was going to say creamy pork blood. 
but mm. the answer is uh, nobody knows what this is. <laughs> it's just like no one it's called rock and rye. There's no rye. Cola. There's no rye flavor. It says artificially flavored cream cola. Oh, cream cola. But this is like this is like the one that everybody knows in Detroit. It's like rock and rye is the is the jam. Creamy I got a lot of grief for my pizza, the pizza episode with the Detroit. Mm. Yeah. So this is me making up for it. The yeah, Fago sorry, stuff. Detroit. Yeah, sorry. They're coming after Speak us. Speak directly to the Detroits. Mm. Detroit. I'm not really that sorry after people were giving me all that crap. So, you know. <laughs> oh, no. yeah. You're actually, yeah, yeah, bitter about you gotta it. Be yeah. You got to be gentle with your criticism. Right. Yeah, yeah. Well, people will sort of tear. This is this is just regular cream soda. Oh, just uh, regular. I feel like a bartender here. Here you go. So yeah. do we have this? Thank you. Th they sell this locally? No. Really? Where do you have to go to Detroit? Uh, <laughs> actually, they we did get it locally, didn't we, Travis? We got it at. Uh, Rocket Fizz, which is like a weird specialty oh, soda yes, store yes. out here. Mm. But this stuff is good. It's just like really good cream soda. I've never, I've never thought that I liked cream soda, but I'm realizing that you know what I do. It yeah, is, it's a good idea. You it, know what I mean? It's, it's a good um, idea. It seems, in my mind, it's a strange juxtaposition. Like, it's, it. If you were to add milk to this, it, that's kind of what my mind. Well, that's what they want thought. you to think. The funny thing about it is, is like it's completely. It's just a flavor hmm. scientist playing a trick on your mind. Yeah. There's nothing cream about this at all. Josh, are you comparing this to the Rock and Rye? Cause there you go. yeah, really similar. I'm yeah. kind of thinking it's just a little bit of food day. You and thought, I don't think this is gonna be much different either. Yeah, you thought Red Pop was the same, and it's... I like the Rock and Rye better because. You have to work to get that cream sensation. Look at Detroit's that. a hard working city. Look yeah. at that natural red color. Blue color. Just, just like a <laughs> strawberry. <laughs> yeah. It says it's strawberry it's soda. It's cream strawberry soda. And it tastes like uh, just a red This cream one's soda. red. This yeah. is red flavor. The yeah. other one wasn't red flavor. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this yep. tastes like a sucker. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I can see how you could get into this, but you know what? You shouldn't. <laughs> oh, you shouldn't. My like, boys, make this you're going after Detroit again. <laughs> wow. no, oh no! no. I'm just saying, in general, like you should limit your intake of this kind of stuff. I feel like I'm gonna, I'm not gonna. This is the last one. Even smell sugar for the next week. Yeah. My boys would love this one because they they they're drawn to the the strawberry flavored dessert. Desserty stuff. We only have two like strawberry ice left. cream and stuff like that. You don't do fruit ice cream, right? No, I'm I'm oh, a okay. I'm a ch I'm a yeah. chocolate, and peanut butter, maybe there a little go. cinnamon. Some not even if there's like fruit oatmeal. in the chocolate, like the cherry cordial style mm -hmm. ice cream. I do not. I don't like that. No, man. Yeah. This is, is known for its medicine-like qualities. So. What, what is this? It's purple. It's purple. Ooh, yeah, that's that great. Good. Did NyQuil get the yeah, flavor from yeah, this? Yeah, I think did so. Did this get yeah. the flavor from NyQuil? Chicken and the egg situation. Uh, nice. NyQuil's really strong. This is this is actually exactly this, what Dimetap tastes Dimetap. like. This you remember might that be, as a kid? Yeah. My favorite one. <laughs> this this is, might be my favorite this one. This is a strong wow. fizz. It's got a bite. I mean, it. I think I think it's uh, got more of a bite than like a new grape. Yeah. yeah. This is by far the worst grape soda I've ever had. Really? really? I'm ready for the city of Detroit to come after me. Now with Alex. <laughs> this is, what a garbage product that is. Oh, they're going to say city. Like, no, 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 no. Love, love you know, in all this probably. fun, I think we forgot that Link has another soda. Today. Oh, that's right. Oh, goodness. Hand me the opener. There you go. I think it's just popped on there. You can probably. Fago, man. It? Yeah. They're really yeah, pumping it out up there. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> it's like so casually on there. <laughs> I mean, oh, no, it's, I mean it's designed to drink from the bottle. Rock and rise. I want rice. you guys to try some. We have root okay. beer too. What is brominated vegetable oil? Is that mm. when like two dudes like <laughs> vegetable oil? <laughs> if you have to stick ask your it. head in that vegetable oil, it's brominated. If you have to ask, you can't afford it. Pass that right down. Also, glycerol ester of wood rosin mm. is inside this beverage. That's glycerol. What? Detroit don't care, man. Throw some wood <laughs> rosin in there. Now let's. Brominate it! <laughs> Give it to the Juggalos. <laughs> <laughs> How do you think they became the way that they did it? Yeah, I was like, probably the, the wood. The wood drink. They're doing it. There's wood rosin. Anybody else want? Uh, Juggalo. Maybe I'll, they're saying I'll, Juggalo I'll wood there. wood instead of whoop whoop, you know? I mean, <laughs> let's see if that's true. I appreciate that. I laughed at that. First of all, that isn't in the red one. That is in the orange one, specifically. So that's far. that wood flavor. All right, it's time to take Josh's original brand cola special drink for a tour of my esophagus. You're a wood guy, man. That's yeah. up your alley. Yeah. yeah. Cheers. Look, I am. Hey. Is that the one you made? Are you drinking that one? Yeah, you try it. That has got some fish in it. 
Well, just a little, I mean, a little bit. Uh, but you get the kind of savoriness, right? Like, you just uh, drink a bunch of instant ramen. It's like an umami taste. Yeah, it's a little bit of umami. Umami it. soda. And what doesn't, what the don't fish. most colas have? <laughs> The fish, hits, the fish hits late. <laughs> yeah. Mine like, looks like I somehow just drank the grape soda again. When you breathe, because I did. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. When you breathe out, that's when it gets real fishy. Mm. You go. I gotta cover yeah, that up. With like some if I only breathe in, it doesn't. Wood. It just yeah. tasted like soy sauce. <laughs> but if you just say that with a positive attitude, then it's a good soda. Oh, like when, when I, you breathe out, it's really fishy. when I breathe out, it's really fishy. See, yeah. yeah. covered up now with some some brominated vegetable oil. <laughs> <laughs> Heading outside. Cover your melon with these hats we're selling. Three different styles to choose from now at mythical.store.